Hi YouTube, Brown Lake Cross and well, today we're doing another episode of Facts on Visions. This time we're doing on Marshall for a change because I know he's one of the most popular visions that everyone loves, isn't it? Well, one of my subscribers actually suggested it for me and obviously you guys are going to, have to probably have to find out because obviously if you look down in the comments you might find who that subscriber might be because at the same time I thought maybe if you guys like, you know, comment down below which one of your favourites are, I might do it for like, you know, Facts on Visions for you guys so they're at least... It's not like me randomly picking a few of them, you know. So it'd be nice if you guys like, you know, comment down below your favourites. And, and if I've got the video cards for them, then I'll probably do them. So let's get into it, shall Marshall has a smug personality because we get along with mostly all villagers except from cranky villagers. Because cranky villagers, apparently they have conflict with smugs, even though it's quite rare. So I'll probably recommend you keeping a smug on your own. But if all your crankies accidentally gets jersey over smugs, be careful, alright? Marshall's birthday is on September 29th, which means he's a Libra. Marshall has the music choir, which means he'll probably, you know, start listening to a few music and start, you know, singing along in his house. And plus, you know, he's like his favourite songs, you know, KK Bozo, which is one of his favourite songs, isn't it? I bet he sings that all day long, don't you think? Because obviously, when you've got the music hobby, you're more obsessed with music. He's that person. I think he's the guy that likes music. And I know that not all um, villagers have that hobby, but he does, which is quite interesting, isn't it? And plus, if you're thinking about it, you, you might see him a few times, you know, like probably singing away, dancing around like he doesn't, like he enjoys the music all the time, enjoys the rhythm of the music. So that's what I mean by music hobby is that it, it's, it's quite rare to see when your villagers have that hobby, but it's quite interesting at the same time. So that's why I quite find it quite, you know, fascinating, you know. If you look at Marshall's colour skin, you know he looks like a marshmallow, doesn't he, at the same time? But he's like adorable, like, marshmallow, like, you know, squirrel. That's what he looks like. So, obviously, I wonder why it catches everybody's, everybody's eye when they see Marshall. Because Marshall looks like he's, got, he's that type that everyone likes. He's like one of those marshmallows. You know when you have those marshmallows in real life and, like, you can't stop snacking them? Well, he resembles a marshmallow, which is quite cool. Quite like his house interior, but obviously we're going to get to the house interior and exit interior as soon. So, let's get to that shower. If you look at Marshall's exterior, it, it has like black and white sort of colours, like, you know, evolving the dark grey, the silvery grey and the white. So that's all associated with dark colours. So I'm sort of thinking if you guys really want him on your eyes for cottage court, I recommend it. If you look at Marshall's house interior, it looks pretty decent, doesn't it? It's quite, you know, fancy. It's got all his stuff that he's got on there as well. And also, as you can tell, he's got like a little piano in the corner and he's got his little sofa with a little, like, you know, coffee cup there. And it looks quite nice. He's got his own little sink and, like, that stuff. I quite like his house. It's quite, you know, decent, isn't it, and fancy. So I was thinking, well, if you guys went on cottage call, go for him. If you guys at like 100% really want him on your eyes, go for him because he's quite, you know, one of the best villagers you can ever think about when it comes to him, you know, because he's, he is one of the most popular ones of, of all time, isn't he? Every time they come to um, AmacosingPaul.com, he's somehow still in tier one. So who knows? Obviously, at the same time, let's get back to the video, shall we? Well, there was a lot of things to go over, but at the same time, make sure you do comment down below which one of your favourite villagers are in, you know. I'm crossing the horizons because at the same time it will it will help me out a lot and also I wouldn't know what to do with myself because I don't want like you know random pick stuff again do I because it sometimes it like you know I don't know which ones you guys like and that stuff that's why it's quite handy if you guys comment down below like which are your favourite villagers in this game so I can then do them like Amiimo cards if I have them or I don't if I don't have the Amiimo cards for them I might have to sit someone someone different in the comments so yeah, I might do that again just so you guys can then, you know, have like a chance of which videos you want me to rank next. Like, you know, do facts and videos on next. So that's why I'm so excited. So that's what I mean. Make sure you like this video if you enjoyed it, of course. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel yet, please do. It will help me out. And as well, go to 50 subscribers or more. If I get to 50 subscribers by this month, it will help me out a lot. And then I'll probably announce my next goal probably next month if we get to that goal, okay? And turn on notifications further and I'm across in and Metopia content from me. That's all I can say, it's goodbye from Around Crossing. I'll see you next one, so bye.